The Earnels, the Earnels, what am I talking about? The owners of Eternal Peace reached out to me and said, hey, Toad, you're gonna wanna make a video so your viewers can play this game because they're gonna love it. And well, I'm gonna check it out right now and see if you guys are actually gonna love it or not. But uh, yeah, we're playing Eternal Peace. Look at this on the loading screen. You got yourself the camera that moves. That's, you know, pretty standard nowadays for games to be high quality like this. But this is a good sign to start up the game. That the game might be high quality. Of course, you got Lox Roots. That's like the big, big game in Roblox right now. They're trying to do something like that. So let's check it out. Uh, let's click play, I guess. I don't know if I can customize anything. But here we are loading into Eternal Peace. Waiting on data to load. Whoa! Okay, all right. For starters, I like this like login reward thing. It's very simplistic, but it also looks kind of nice. Not gonna lie. Let's claim that we get an hour two times XP and I am a, a female, I think. I, I don't know. I, I am a person right now because I didn't actually customize my thing, but let's talk to Nicholas. My level is too low. All right, let's not talk to Nicholas. Whoa, the dash is kind of cool. Talk to Eric. Wow. Okay, first of all, the map looks crazy. The models look okay. Like the character right here, he's a little funky looking, but the map itself looks good. The UI looks interesting. What I really like so far within the first five seconds of me actually playing the game is that you can see the little bottom left screen right here that you're on Starter Island. There's a whole map and you can kind of see where everything is. There's Arlong Park, Barati Arena, and then some other areas, Jungle Island and Marine Island. Okay, that's uh. That's pretty cool. We got a whole menu area here. Oh, free fruit. Uh, okay, that's kind of cool. You got to follow them, but you get a free fruit. All right, what else we got here? We got a shop here. Oh. Ooh, I can spend Bodux. I'm in trouble. All right, so it looks like the most expensive fruit is the Rumble, Rumble fruit, and the Dark, Dark fruit. I think I have enough Roblox to get the clear, clear fruit though, right? Uh. Maybe. Don Don. Can I get that? Nope. I don't have enough for Don Don. I might have enough for the clear, clear fruit, though. I'm not going to get it. Uh, I might get a fruit here in a second, but settings, customize. You can actually customize in game. Okay, thank goodness. Let me just go customize real quick here. So there's actually quite a ton of customizations. I can be a marine or I can be a pirate. I'm the pirate, of course, and you can change all your character customizations here on this page. And I'm not going to lie, I kind of like it. I'm, I'm not going to make anything too crazy, but there's a ton of different options for character customizations which is really cool actually um i guess i'm a female pirate okay there we go we're nope we're back to okay there we go that one right there we'll put on uh yeah th those legs right there oh yeah that's it right there and then the shoes we'll just make them all black like this primary hair oh okay cool so we don't oh my gosh what is this what is this Oh my goodness, this is actually kind of crazy. Okay, skin tone, eh, we'll just uh, leave it like this. Okay, color for what? Huh? Oh wait, not skin. Let's select the shirt. Can I make this my shirt color? Oh, cool. Okay, ow, that is like an ugly color. Okay, there's a ton of stuff that you guys can do here in order to customize your characters. I'm gonna customize really, really, customize mine really, really quickly here to make it look, uh, a little bit decent, I guess, and I'll be right back. What am I doing? Okay, we got ourselves some spins here. I can spin my race. I got Skype in on my first roll. Okay, that's interesting. It gave us the wings. I kind of was not expecting that. And we got Mink. Oh my gosh, Mink's a 4%. We're definitely keeping this. I even look like a bunny. Finalized customization. Yes, that was pretty cool. I, that customization setting there was pretty nice. I liked how that looked and oh my goodness, we look insane this is <laughs> what is this <laughs> so i click the little left button over here it says track quest i can actually just track the quest which is pretty nice um there's a, a boat seller if you need a boat let me see what you got i can't buy no boats i don't have enough belly for this i got absolutely zero belly this person's over here fishing oh they look kind of cool i'm not gonna lie but um, let me check, oh wait, do I get like double jump because I'm Mink or something? I don't know. Anyways, what I gotta do is I gotta interact with him again. I gotta collect two marine items. Um, 
Yeah, I'm not really sure where that's gonna be. Maybe I gotta like attack these guys first in order for me to get marine items. Huh, huh, huh. Oh yeah, combat feels pretty good. F to block. Ow, don't turn around though, because you can't block when you're backwards. Ha, <laughs> makes sense, of course. I I'm just so good at these kinds of games, guys. Oh, I leveled up already, nice. Um, yeah, we're so good. I you know it's gonna make me even better if I just spend the Loblex to get really, really OP, but maybe I can try to collect these. Ow, 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 ow. No, okay. And I was gonna say, maybe I can try to get like really OP by collecting, you know, OP, uh, I was gonna call them quirks, but ulti fruits, which is what I think I'll do here in just a second. But what I do wanna share with you guys is the new codes, because there's actually a, a ton of codes available for you guys. So go over here to the menu, go to the code section. First code is 25 race spins. You might even be able to get Nink like I got it, because it's gonna give you guys 25 rerolls. We got a huge code right here, give me four hours of EXP and that's literally gonna give you guys uh, four hours of EXP. This next code is I need a max win and it gives you guys a free fruit. I'm gonna do that last, I'm gonna get whatever that fruit gives me last because obviously we want to make sure that we get something good. Stat reset five is another code. So it uh, gives you five stat refunds, which I can't use. And then finally sub to King Baka, which actually will give you guys another Fruit. So we got all those fruits there, or fruits that we haven't opened yet. But let's go ahead and do it right now. So click on this first fruit, the bonbon fruit. What is this one? The candy cane fruit. All right, well, hold on. I gotta check out the shop here. Candy cane costs $2.99 and the bonbon costs $1.99. So I think I'm definitely gonna use the candy cane one just cause it's more expensive. Uh, let's eat that. Oh my goodness, that was so insane right there. Here's the candy cane fruit, and on the right-hand side, you guys can see all the moves that we can do. So it seems like you need the skill points. Okay, so we're gonna have to track skill points and give it into our fruits as well. But let's go check out the one move we can do, which is the candy spear, it's a letter Z. Oh my gosh, was that me? Was that actually my like fruit ability? Because if so, that was huge. Oh, that's sick. Okay, wait, the fruit abilities might actually be pretty fired because this is a pretty weak fruit and that's literally just the first attack from this fruit, but it looks really kind of cool. Okay, I'm getting my, my butt. What? What? I got destroyed by the bandits. What? I'm not this bad, am I? Oh my gosh, this is probably a bad idea for me to target all these bandits at once, but maybe I can kill them if I just keep dodging them. Uh die yeah get owned scrubs oh yeah that was so good i just gotta collect them all at once like that free experience aka free shavaka do i'm gonna give myself some points into my devil fruit here let's see five points there let's see like we need some more stamina so we can attack more often our melee and our defense defense will give us some more hp and then more fruit points because obviously we want to get the strongest fruit points possible in the shortest amount of time. It's gonna be like one of those opposite videos where it's like, I spent 24 hours on the game. No, there's gonna be one of those. I spent 24 minutes on the game and this is how far I got. Uh, so let me go ahead and just start. Hey, 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 you're like my brother, come back. You're blue, you're like me, hello. Hello, you look just like me. How's it going, brother? It's like Sonic and I am uh, Knuckles. Hello, hello. <laughs> All right, uh, anyways, here's a quick time lapse. I'll do that once I can progress through a bit more of the stage. So my hair is really big, but the first thing you guys gotta get is this cap right here. That's one of the two marine items here. I think I literally just abandoned the quest as I found the cap for the first time. So so that's that's so nice. I'm so glad that I, uh, I decided to just, just Anyways, uh, you gotta find the marine caps or other marine items around the map, which I'm assuming they're gonna be here in this middle town. That's the first thing you gotta do. And hopefully, yeah, it just gives you money, but hopefully it also gives you guys some level up stuff. Did it respawn yet? Oh, it did, cool. So maybe this will count now if I collect it. Gosh, guys, my character models do big for this. All right, I totally found this by myself without any help. And well, this isn't what I was looking for. I guess there's another uh, marine item that we gotta look for that isn't the same thing, which of course makes sense, but why? I just wish it could be over. My name is not Tobo Gaming, and I'm actually gonna be able to solo this boss by myself, maybe because I'm so good at this game right here. Look at that, the boss has 30 HP. Yeah, he, he's like, watch, watch, I'm not even looking at him. Hiya, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm so bad at these kinds of games. <laughs> 
<laughs> Watch and let us summon the entire mob army enemy. Whoa, we actually did manage to kill it though. Did we get a drop? No, we didn't even get a drop. And I don't know where to find this last stupid marine item. It literally makes no sense. These people are out here having full on brawls and I'm literally just looking for a marine item. It's literally Aokiji versus, uh, what's his face? Admiral Magma guy. Yeah, it's, it's pretty cool actually, the battles that are going on right here. The Magma fruit's pretty interesting, but the ice fruit's pretty crazy looking. Not, like, what is that? I see, I was doing the wrong quest. Like, I don't know why I was spending so much time trying to do that marine quest. It's like, this person right here has the level one quest that you guys should be doing, because A, it's gonna give you guys a decent amount of experience, and B, it's gonna give you guys the money that you potentially need for you to unlock the next part of the quest, which is to buy a bow, apparently, even though I can just uh, use a regular bow, my goodness, a regular bow to just get where I wanna go, no. Oh my gosh, okay, I think I survived. I think I survived this. Yeah, and he dies. Yeah, noob, you don't got, no, no, I'm dead, okay. <laughs> All right, well, we finished that quest for level 14. Technically, we can start to learn Gepo, but it costs 10,000 belly, which I definitely don't have enough belly or enough hunger to get that. Get it, belly? Anyways, um, we're gonna go over here to this quest guy here, James. Uh, say, if you'd like to buy my fishing rod for 2500 I don't have enough money for any of this. Can I, like, cheat money? Uh, ooh. Ooh. The answer is yes. So make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on. Let me know what you guys think of the game so far. Like I said, I don't play these games very often, and I'm not very good at them. But so far, so far, I'm being very genuine with this. This one looks kind of good. Like, they're doing something here. They're, they're cooking. This may potentially have a potential competition with Blocks Fruit sometime here in the future. Especially since I just did their first update. But what we're going to do here is get ourselves some belly. 300,000 belly sounds like a lot of belly. So we're just going to get 300,000 here. What we can do is we can get this fishing rod from this person, person right here. James, deal. Alright, it takes up to five minutes to catch something, James? Are you kidding me? What am I, a noob? I'm not gonna catch, oh my gosh, it's literally gonna take two minutes for me to catch something. Well, I've been sitting here for about 18 hours now, almost, no, sorry, 23 and a half hours uh, just sitting here and fishing, and look at what I got as a catch right here, guys. Uh. Huh? 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 Fishing sucks! All right, anyways guys, let's check out the new islands. Like I said, you can spawn your boat right here from this spawn guy and maybe I won't die. Okay, I don't die, nice. Oh, I love this boat. I just let the water take me. Water take me, please. Are we even moving? There we go, now we're moving. Maybe, it's just that the water's moving. I think just the water's moving. Oh my goodness, am I in the wrong seat? Hello? There we go, now we can move. If we look at the map here. Oh, I like how you can actually look at the map to where you're going. The arena's over here, Baratil, Arlong Park, or Marines Island. I think we need to go to Marines Island first, right? That sounds like the first, no, that sounds wrong. I, I don't know guys, somebody, somebody help me please. Holy smokes, there's an entire CDs after me, guys. What is going on? Wait, that's actually kind of cool. That might actually be a nice thumbnail right there. Look at that. Wait, come over here, Mr. CDs. Come kill- No, no, come back, come back, come kill me. Wait, wait, I need a thumbnail with you. I wasn't ready yet. Hello? Mr. CDs. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, there it is. Can I, like, run forward, though? Thanks, I don't want to actually die to the sea. I don't want to actually die to the sea beast, okay, game? Thanks. Okay, well, there's the sea. Oh my gosh, that looks sick. Okay, not gonna lie, this is looking pretty cool. The fact that you gotta fight this guy in the water, too, is pretty crazy. You can get the sea beast cape and the ice dagger. Now, of course, the sea beast is actually too strong for me, but we're stubborn and we were gonna try to fight it. But nope, we're 
which is bad. All right, all right, I don't got too much time left because I do gotta go uh, and catch an airplane. But what I do have is a little bit of the lick so I can get one of these things. I can either get the Nagma Nagma fruit, which is 999, the flame flame fruit. I can get any of these fruits, honestly, except for these 29 and 99 So what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get myself the magma magma fruit. Oh, the light. We're getting the light light fruit. Yes, 100% getting the light light fruit. That's probably gonna be the best fruit that we can get. Cool. Okay, so we got ourselves the light light fruit and now it equips and oh boy. That right there is is nice that's nice right there guys can you believe that that's me I am the owner of this light fruit guys honestly this game is pretty cool I'm not gonna lie if I wasn't like supposed to go on vacation right now and I didn't have to leave to go catch a plane I would keep playing eternal peace but I'm gonna leave the link to you guys can play it in the description down below let's check out what light kick looks like real quick yep that's pretty cool that's pretty cool. Let's see how much damage it does too, and it only costs 15 stamina. That's pretty nice. Here's like, <laughs> it nearly destroyed the bandit, and I just realized that we also get the sword to attack with too. So that's pretty nice, and it uh, it looks pretty sick. And look at that, the attack is nearly immediate for that light kick. Yeah, that light fruit is pretty strong. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. If you do want to play the game, like I said, I'll link it down below. Let me know what you think of the game, and I will see you guys later. Also, if you want to see me actually do a 24 hour instead of a 24 minute thing, let me know. For now, that's it. I'll see you guys later. Reese's Deezes. Bye.